Hello everybody, welcome back to today's video. Today we're going to be looking at how you can use the 5PD item creator, which is kind of a Windows uh, executable file where you can actually create um, items pretty easily rather than manually doing it in an items.yml or items.json file for your 5PD server. So all you have to do to do this is go ahead and click download this file. You'll accept this. Uh, make sure you read it over if you haven't already. Just click the newest one. I'm going to do 1.0.2 is the newest at the time of recording and you can see it's gone ahead and downloaded. So I'm going to go ahead and click this and what we want to do is we want to put this into a folder. So we're going to right click on your desktop, go fo new folder and I can say like item creator. If you already have a items.json file and you can find that in your server data resources 5pd folder and you can find that in your config items.json you can use this and drag it into this folder. If you don't want to use your pre-made items file which already comes with a few items if I remember yes it already comes with these items which I want to use it so I'm going to go ahead and copy this into my other folder here but if you don't want to use it it will create its own when you run the program which is pretty cool. Alright so we're going to go ahead and go ahead and double click this and you can see it's going to go ahead and open it says the contents of items.json has been loaded. To add more items all you have to do is enter the name of the item you want. I'll go dog bag. Is it an illegal item? Yes or no? No. Enter the multiplier. I'll do 10. Where should this item appear? Vehicles, peds, both. I'm going to go ahead and do both. Item created, dog bag. So you can see if I go back into the items.json file, at the bottom it will say dog bags. And you can see it's gone ahead and created. And that's mostly the most common item it seems. And you can do this as many times as you want. If you want it to be YT uh, sub goal plaque or something. And is it a legal item? No. And to the multiplier, like 0.5 or something, or just one. Um, is it a legal? No. And to the multiplier, one. There you go. So you can see it's appearing in both. Um, so pretty much, pretty easy thing to use. Pretty easy thing to create items with. I just wanted to create this quick tutorial on downloading. Literally type it out. Uh, noodles. Is it a legal item? Yes, noodles are illegal. What's the multiplier? 100. Should it appear in both? There you go. So it's an illegal noodle item. For everybody so you can create as many as you want here very easy to use very easy to do things with so keep it up and great job to the creators of 5pd for making this extra resource for everybody to create items rather than going in and manually making it with json files so great job continue working on it can't wait to see what it becomes in the future thank you to all of the users who have subscribed with the free 5pd and 5m content recently it's been amazing i'm sorry if i'm mispronouncing words this is my seventh video of the day i need to get videos out for the whole week and i'm very tired so i apologize but this is how you create more items for your 5pd server thank you so much for watching my name is noodles and i'll see you in tomorrow's video